Guys, before we begin, Brandon, who works on this channel with me and is the voice behind a lot of the scripts that I narrate, now has his own Twitter account, so if you want to follow him or me, links down in the description, you can get your bad hockey takes straight from the horse's mouth. You know, I thought this Carolina-New Jersey series might be a little boring, but wow, was I wrong. The first period of this game saw arguably my hit of the year. However, before that, we got another pretty big bit of contact, as Fast really lays into Graves, and I mean nice hit I guess but this is pretty clearly interference and you could argue boarding or charging anyway almost immediately after in the same sequence Kotkaniemi would absolutely lay out Nico Heischer who got caught trying to play a puck stuck in his skates and this is the perfect hit he squares up with the hip lays him out right in the chest yeah there's a bit of follow through that sees his legs leave the ice but he doesn't jump to make the hit just clean massive that is what I love to see and that that got me excited. That really got the home team Carolina crowd jacked up, as did Carolina's play really throughout the period. I heard someone say that the game looked like there were five Rod Brindamores out at all times, plus one behind the bench, and that's pretty accurate. New Jersey completely outworked in this one. Oh, they even got a penalty on that sequence with the two big hits. The Devils would press early on a pair of power plays, but Anderson stood tall. Schmidt also had a couple of nice saves, but Kakaniemi would open the scoring two minutes into the second on the power play. It would start off a rebound, Carolina wins a puck battle, Kotkaniemi has a ton of room and buries it far side. And at the beginning of the period, Carolina was just absolutely all over the Devils. Four minutes in, they'd throw bodies on the forecheck, have the puck pop out as Martinook wins the two-on-one board battle, Kotkaniemi finishes his second in the slot. Still in the second, a bad pinch by the Devils and a really nice chip would give Stahl a breakaway, which he would finish nicely. Carolina would add one. Before period end, however, clearly interference. But wait, I think Schmid may have been a bit it rattled as afterwards he would try to play the puck it would go right back to Carolina the initial shot would miss but it would be finished off to take the 4-0 lead going into the second and that would be the end of Schmid's night the real whiplash I think is going to come looking at his stat sheet and seeing the games that he just shuts the Rangers down versus the times that he's been blown up although tonight not his fault anyway all said and done the Hurricanes would take this one 6-1 and are now going to New Jersey with a 2-0 series lead well Schmidt in New Jersey bounce back or are the Hurricanes on their way to a pretty easy four or five game series victory? Let me know your thoughts down below and again check those links in the description to follow us on Twitter. I don't have enough people following me for hockey stuff. It's all Star Wars. It gets kind of annoying.